In January 2020, as part of various ongoing initiatives, we were drawn to several low-income settlements across Chennai. What caught our attention uniformly across all these settlements was the sight of children playing on the streets despite the poor quality of the public realms owing to the small size of their home units. It became obvious and imperative that the commons had to be reimagined with this new perspective, with children as catalysts. In addition, the COVID pandemic reiterated this need to rethink the performance minimums for our commons, both quantitatively and qualitatively. This was the genesis of the Cities for Play project. In March 2020, we approached the Tamil Nadu Slum Clearance Board and pitched this idea to them. The officials were supportive and suggested that we test the idea at Ayodhya Nagar, a fishing village which recently went through an in-situ upgrade. While the tenements themselves seemed to be fairly well made, it was the unbuilt spaces that lacked attention. For a community that traditionally valued the beach and the sea waters as its commons, a major arterial road currently severs this relationship. Instead, we have a large central court, residual pockets along the periphery, mid-block access corridors and service alleys. These are the spaces that comprise the new shared commons for this community, but are found wanting to be reinstated with a sense of ownership and responsibility. We started with a detailed assessment of the site conditions to arrive at a design for the public realm, along with a stakeholder engagement strategy to gather support and enthusiasm for the project, and also to identify locally available skill sets towards implementation. Given that Chennai has not had a local body election since 2016, fundraising has been possible only through grant programs and CSR channels. A community sporting event is planned for December 2020, coupled with a cleanup drive and awareness program on solid waste management. This event will be followed up with implementation in a few chosen pockets using the funds raised so far. Further, we hope to incrementally and collectively realize this vision for a reimagined commons at Ayodhya Nagar. But Cities for Play doesn't end here because there are several more such settlements and fishing villages across Chennai and Ayodhya Nagar can only be a beacon to more such transformations.